Hi, I'm Dr. Joy Howard and I work with students here at Heritage who are interested in English education, psychology, and interdisciplinary studies. And I want to talk to you a little bit about what to do if you need academic help here at Heritage University. And I want to introduce you to some of my friends who are in charge of different centers and programs that provide academic support here on campus. First, I want to introduce you to Mel Hill, who works here at the Academic Skills Center, or the ASC as most people know it. Hi, my name is Melissa Mel Hill. Welcome to the Academic Skills Center. At Heritage University, it's important for us to support every student with high quality tutoring so that they can be successful in their academics. When you visit the Academic Skills Center, you'll be greeted by our tutor coordinator. She will be able to assist you with finding a tutor who can support you in any subject area while attending classes here at Heritage University. If one of our tutors isn't available, you can always use SmartThink, a 24-7 online tutoring program that you can access anywhere as long as you have internet connection through your MyHeritage portal. So there's a snapshot of the ASC. We hope you like what you see and we encourage you to come visit us, see what we have to offer. And don't forget, we have free coffee here. Now I'd like to introduce you to my friend Daryl Parks who works in the Don North Library. Hi, I'm Daryl Parks. I'm the reference librarian at Heritage University. I'm going to tell you three things about the library. Thing number one, the library has a huge amount of information, most of which you cannot find through Google. We have books, we have access to journals where scientists and scholars publish new discoveries and studies. We have a website full of informational goodies. Thing number two, anything we don't have, we can get. We have good relationships with a bunch of other libraries and schools, so any book, any article that we don't have, we can borrow or get a copy from them. You can do this one of two ways. There's a form on our website, that's how most people do it. And you can also use the paper form if you are a traditionalist. Thing number three, all the librarians that work here are wicked smart and committed to helping you succeed. Hearing about you doing well on a paper or acing a presentation makes us feel all warm and fuzzy inside. So if you have questions or you need help with anything research or information related, there are lots of ways to get in touch with us. You can call us, you can text us, you can chat with us on our website, you can send us email, and of course, you can always just come by and talk to us. Welcome to Heritage. We're glad you're here. Now I want to introduce you to Paula Colucci, who heads up our brand new writing center where students go to perfect their writing skills. Welcome to the Writing Center. My name is Paula Colucci. This Writing Center is filled with computers to use to compose your essays and also books to help you with citation methods that you might be required for your use in papers. But we also have a lot of tutors here on hand for you for one-on-one -on -one help. No one is born a good writer. Writers are built. They work hard. They're kind of like athletes. It's a skill that's developed. Here at the Writing Center, we like to provide you with the assistance and the cheerleading and the direction that you might be lacking on your own. Writing is not a solitary act. Writing is meant to be read, which means that you need partners to help you get through the writing process. And that's exactly what we do here at the Writing Center. Now that I've introduced you to several folks who are here to support you academically, I just want to fill you in on a couple more things. One, we have designed an academic advising syllabus that will help you to plan for some major events and checkpoints during your first year here. We'll talk about that at NSO and you can find it on our website for academic advising. If you get into trouble with your grades for classes, call for help. It's a good idea to exchange information with your classmates on the first day of class. If you're absent or you miss some assignments and have simple questions, you can call them. Another idea is communicating with your professors, letting them know if you're going to miss class or if you have a question about an assignment. Just remember that your academic advisor is always here to help, so feel free to give us a call.